Just thought I'd test it with the default settings too. That got by. Now let's turn this off. And I wish I had task kill run going right now. Um, so that has got by. Um, let's see. That's like an all-in-one tool right here. Has everything. Options. Uh, advanced. High sensitive mode. Now let's see what happens when I try to re-download this again. Systems. That's probably that's not good. Let's fix this. As you can see, it keeps trying to modify the registry. It wants to put it there so it can launch automatically. I keep hearing a beeping in my headphones every time this does it tries to add. And I see, I just don't see anything getting by with this the max settings on here, um, which is great for a uh, you know home user. Yeah, I'm getting spammed by that uh, process that keeps trying to. Holy moly. I have just formatted my machine. Uh, that's what happens. Yeah, I want to fix now. Uh, yeah, I mean, with these max settings on Twister, there's nothing that's going to. Any kind of zero day thing. Uh, when you got this high sensitivity mode on, um, it's just not going to really get by because of the check that's enabled there. And uh, go ahead and turn on normal sensitive mode. Looks like that's not going to get by. Might be a dead link. Um, okay, I made my uh, list here a little less convoluted. So these are all zero day stuff right here. So. Um, So that's a really good thing right there that it uh, stops that site from getting infected. Here's this. Let's try this. It is constantly telling me that something is trying to modify the registry, which is great. Clean. I mean, I'm just being honest right here. This is uh, I'm really surprised here. Twister antivirus. 
I'm going to go ahead and pause, do a restart, and come back up. See what happens when I reboot the machine. Okay, I've just done a reboot. Um, we're back up. Uh, I'm exiting out of the Immunet. Looks like nothing's really started up yet. This is a 30 day free trial that has everything running. Tell it to continue to try. Um, there's that thing, still trying to get on there. It's uh, telling me to delete the value, but once I delete it, it'll continue to uh, re-simulate itself into the re registry. I'm not seeing Safe Fighter, actually. Um, I'm not seeing anything at all. The reason I'm testing this longer than usual is because I've been so impressed with it that I, I, I want to keep learning more about it. Um, man, it's just a nice little program um, that uh, a guy recommended to me to try out. I had never heard of it. The guy's name was uh, Fuzzfuss off of uh, Wilder's uh, security forums, which I'm a member of because I, I do... Uh, I run ESET and I get on there and talk on the ESET forums. Um, turn this on. I'm going to go ahead and let it do a scan, see what it finds. I turned on the auto uh, immunize. While it's running a uh, scan, let's uh, upload this. I'm just sitting here and thought I might as well do that. Um, Looks like it's immunized 15 things. It's finding stuff that the that it didn't let get by. Um, gonna head pause this. Looks like my Internet Explorer has gotten eaten. <laughs> Just unpausing the video again. Um, I can't get out the internet because my Internet Explorer has been immunized or something. It's uh, detected uh, 146 things it's went in and uh, deleted off. So it's finding stuff, tons of stuff. Looks like we're up to uh, 140, 148 um, detections right here that it's going in and immunizing behind itself. Um, Probably stuff whenever I dumb the settings down to the default settings. Uh, stuff that got passed and installed on here. If I'd have left those max settings on, I don't really think anything would be getting on. Um, I just tried to do that to, uh, to show how it would operate out of the box if you didn't go in and tweak it out. Um, which I don't know why you wouldn't do that in the first place. Um, if you're worried about, you know, nag screens for people, um, personally, I, it doesn't bother me. But, you know, if you're in a business environment, uh, you'd want all this stuff to be automated, uh, which I don't really think this is a hardcore big business uh, type of product. This is kind of, uh, you know, something you run on your own computer or a friend's computer that you build for them. Um, it's really awesome. From what I'm seeing on the website here, which, sorry, I'm is uh, you can go on here and do a buy now and it's a lifetime twenty nine ninety nine um product here which is pretty cool. It's look at this. It is finding it is just eating up stuff. This would be a great program to run for cleaning if you are working in I know we've on our voyage to be sysadmins or network admins. IT directors, we all probably start out working in a uh, mom and pop store. You know, I did while I was going to college, cleaning virus infected machines. And uh, a lot of people don't want their machine formatted, so you got to run Combo Fix. Or um, back then, I'd run ESET and Spyware Doctor. But this would be something that I definitely use. <laughs> I had to go in and clean stuff off um, after testing it today. Look at this. It's found. Look at all this stuff. It's immunizing. It's just climbing and climbing and climbing. 
all this stuff and deal 